Creek by Sandra Hosky. The setting is a riverbank. A wet Jerry wearing a life jacket stumbles in. Oh, thank God. Dry land. I love you, Dirt. I love you. Jerry! Here! Jerry! Up here, Bill. Bill enters, also wearing a life jacket. Oh, there you are. What the hell are you doing? Becoming one with the earth, man. <laughs> Where's Adam? I don't know, man. The last time I saw him, he was in the raft looking down at me with his worried look. At least I think he was worried. It's just like him staying in the boat as we get thrown out. Something hit us, man. Something big. A rock? No way. There was, like, no rock. There was a damn crocodile or something. <laughs> There's no crocs in this river. It's the Pacific Northwest, man. It was some sort of undiscovered <laughs> river monster then, man. It was a rock. I saw its tail right before... Jesus! What if it got at him? What if it leapt out of the water, grabbed him by the face, and pulled him under? What if he's fish bait? Don't even joke about that shit, man. Poor Adam. I wish they had taken the last beer now. I knew it! What? <laughs> you took the last one! Okay, okay, who cares? Adam's out there on the river without paddles, and we're stuck up Shit Creek. <laughs> shit Creek. There's a reason why they call it that, and this is it. Why did we take the fork? We're supposed to go the other way. When I tell you to paddle hard left, you paddle hard left. I was paddling left. It's easy for you to say, Captain Jerry. I don't remember seeing you hold an oar. Oh, it must have been Adam's fault then. Yeah. We should be at Dawson's Marina. Six packs, babes in bikinis, sun, line in the water, and smell of steaks on the grill. Oh, yeah. But I'm stuck here with you. <laughs> Splash! A ripped up life jacket tumbles in. Jerry, look. Oh, Lordy. What is it, Jerry? It's Adam's life jacket. How do you know? His wife wrote his name on it. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Adam. We hardly knew ye. We grew up together, man. <laughs> well, at least he's in a better place. I hope so. Where the hell are we? How the hell should I know? You camped in this area as a kid, didn't you? Know these hills like the back of my ass, you said. Well, not this particular hill. Where's the map? <coughs> Adam had it last. God rest his soul. Amen. I need a drink. Splash! Drink washes up on shore. <laughs> Ask and you shall receive. Manna from heaven. They drink. Well, it's going to be dark soon. We should start a fire. With what? All my shit's in the boat. Lucky for you, I have these waterproof matches in my pocket. You think of everything, don't you? I try. Makes me sick. Well, I guess you wouldn't want a fire then. No, no. Go ahead. I'll get some wood. I need to dry out. I can't think when I'm wet. But you can drink when you're wet. I can drink anywhere. <laughs> Jerry gathers some wood. He finds a wooden sign that reads, Beware. What's that? It looks like a sign. <laughs> Beware. You can read. <laughs> Beware of what? Splash! Calypso washes up tangled in a fishing line. Ah! <laughs> what the hell is that? Wow. Calypso rises, untangling herself. Jerry, how many drinks have I had? <clears throat> Not enough. Whose hook is this? Kiss. Who are you? Hello, gentlemen. Did you just... Where did you come from? Out there. But you're completely dry. That's impossible. Isn't it? <laughs> How do you a phone? Nice move, Jerry. A pre pretty girl jumps out of the water completely dry and you ask for a phone? Are you lost? Yes. Us? No. We're just doing a little camping. In life jackets. <laughs> In case there's a flood. We got thrown <laughs> from our raft. Ended up here. Knocked out by a river monster. River monster? He's just well, messing with you. No, long tail, big teeth. I've heard of it. You have? Small, beady eyes. Yeah, I don't believe this. What don't you believe? This, you, that a mythical river monster threw us out of our boat, ate our friend, and then you came up from out of the water completely dry? It does seem a little far-fetched, but I have a better story. 
Rub-a-dub-dub, three men in a tub. And how do you think they got there? Butcher, banker, mattress maker. Is this a riddle? Who are you? Callie. <sighs> Look, lady, do you have a phone or not? I do not. I am sorry. Do you know the way to a boat launch? There are many boat launches on this river. Listen, little girl, we're not interested in your game. Well, I'm interested, but my wife's voice is pretty loud in my head. Right now. I think it's time you took a nap. <laughs> I'm pretty tired. He drops to the ground in a deep sleep. How did you do that? He was pretty tired. How do you feel? Confused? What happened to Adam, really? If you cared so much, why did you jump out of the boat? I didn't. How did you know that? So bored, so tired of your old friends, leaning so far over the edge, so easy, kerplop. And Jerry? Tangled in fishing wire. When you went in, you drug him in with you. What did you do with Adam? <laughs> Don't come any closer. I'm armed. He holds out a match. Relax. <laughs> your friend is in a safe place. Who are you? I told you. My name is Callie. Are you an angel? Am I dead? I was in the water. I thought I was going to drown. No, William. You're not dead. Look at me. Your eyes. I see waterfalls. What else do you see? Myself wearing a little fig leaf in front of my... and daisies oh. on my head. <laughs> oh, look. I'm skipping through a field of tulips. I, that fig leaf doesn't cover much. <laughs> <laughs> Do you feel happy? Oh, yes. It was I, William. I who brought you here. Where is here? Paradise. Everything you've ever dreamed of. And me. Are you sure I'm not dead? <laughs> Quite sure. Wouldn't you like to stay here? You will want for nothing. That sounds nice. <laughs> Get your hands off him, Peg! I thought I put you to sleep. Jerry shows her a vial. Anti-mythological spell serum. <laughs> <laughs> William, Calypso here. takes Bill's face in her hand. I think he means to hurt me. Don't look at her, Bill. That's how she traps you. But she's so nice to look at. She'll <laughs> steal your soul, Who man. Who are you? Defender of all that's holy. Protector of truthness. You're worst nightmare. I thought you were Jerry Smith. You're not a feckless fisherman? No. Jerry pulls a pair of glasses out of his pocket and puts them on. Gerald! That's right, baby. <laughs> I only posed as a feckless fisherman to fool you. I've been searching for you, and when I heard about the disappearances along this river, I had to come and look for myself. I brought my friend along here because I knew the likes of you couldn't resist the likes of him. Slow with it. Simple-minded. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Easy to control. You think you can resist me? I know I can. Calypso takes Jerry's face in her hands and licks his face. He starts to succumb. Bill gets jealous and turns her toward him. Hey! What is it you want, Callie? Or should I say Calypso? <gasps> Is that supposed to mean something? <laughs> you should really read up on your mythology, man. This here's Calypso's island. Those who stumble upon it can never leave. She won't let them. It isn't me. It's the curse. I didn't mean to hurt anybody. I'm just lonely. Horse, pucky. I only have, I only have one beer, I swear. How would you like to be stuck out here in the middle of nowhere on an island for centuries, waiting to be rescued but knowing you never can be? So you hope for a companion, someone who would make the choice to stay. There's nothing to do out here, no malls, no good chain restaurants, just trees and rocks and snakes. I hate snakes! Aww. I'm hallucinating. Jerry? Jerry picks up a stick and points it at Callie. Prepare to meet your destiny. Oh, what are you going to do? Prick me with your little stick? Splash, an oar washes up. Jerry picks it up. I'll use my big stick then, thank you. <laughs> William, are you going to let him do this? N no. Don't listen to her, Billy. She's an expert manipulator. Am I? Am I? <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, I don't mind. 
<laughs> I'm not the one who promised to be there forever and left the first chance he got. Men always making oaths they have no intention of keeping, leaving their underwear all over the forest. Well, if somebody <laughs> would talk in her sleep. I don't talk in my sleep. Hermes? Odysseus? Bob? Oh, <laughs> it meant nothing. Jerry, look at me. Not a chance in Hades. Jerry raises the oar. He makes a move to run her through, but she grabs Bill and uses him as a shield. The oar stabs him in his head. <laughs> oh! Oops! Bill! You missed! No! Now, what would you like for supper? Meatloaf or fried river monster? Go to Hades! Jerry stabs her with a stick. shakes him. Bill! Bill, he speaks to me! Uh, Jerry! Oh, thanks, Zeus. I feel a draft in my torso. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, my friend. Where are we? Where do you think we are? Last thing I remember was watching you steal the last beer! So you don't remember the river monster? The lonely yet nefarious water nymph? I think you've had one too many. Splash! The raft splashes up. The raft! Come on, let's go. I'll help you. Where's Adam? I'm not sure. Jerry? <laughs> Bill? Hey, Jerry. Next weekend, can we just play poker? I'll bring the tips. Deuce is wild. Anything you say, man. <laughs>